What's the best flavor of Doritos? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Once in a while we'll come across a food that has a lot of flavor variations, but not quite enough for a gut check where we taste like 30 flavors. Uh huh. For instance, Doritos. And I've been asking, what's the best way to determine the best flavor of these foods without someone's wonky opinion skewing the results? I like that word, wonky. Uh, and I'm excited because the crew has come through with a new format where democracy prevails. It's time for In Flavor of Doritos Edition. Welcome to the Voting Vortex Zone. Gentlemen, today you won't be tasting alone because we've gathered a beautiful panel of tasters with a wide array of tastes and sensibilities who will help definitively determine the best Doritos flavor. We've got Jordan from Sporked who wrote Sporked's definitive ranking of Doritos, a Doritos expert. Oh, qualifications. Whoa, 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 we don't have those. <laughs> we've got Kaylin who doesn't like cheese but loves spice, a Doritos wild card. Oh, wow, okay. And we've got Matt Lieb representing the every man, the Doritos proletariat. Yeah. yeah. I love them all. Is that yeah, what, that's right. Is that what proletariat means? I just read it and I hope that's correct. Sounds you will right. each try each flavor of traditional Doritos available in the U.S. one by one and head to head each round. Rhett and Link will lead our panel of tasters in deciding if the flavor at hand oh, is good like enough that. to oust the current flavor leader. In order for a flavor to remain or become the front runner, it needs a minimum of three votes. I love, can I say I love this? Yeah. If you can count how many people are up there, I there are five people. I don't love it. I don't love dissipating my power because of complaints. Well, I didn't say that part. <clears throat> <clears throat> Rhett and Link, if you're in agreement as to which flavor is superior, you only need one vote from the panel to agree with you. But if you're split, you'll need to convince at least two people on the panel to vote with you in order to get your flavor to advance. Oh, begging and bribery? Exactly. We'll go through the list of flavors in alphabetical order, which means today we're starting with... Cool Ranch versus Cool that. Ranch Flamin' Hot there's, Edition. There's too much flavor on that one. I didn't grab that one. Yeah, I just think it would throw us off too much. It looks so good. I want it so bad, but it's too much flavor on it. Mmm. Mmm. That's such a good chip. I mean, it is such a good chip. It's a triumph in snacking. It's ranch, but it's cooler. Over here, I see no hint of ranch. Well, the I, ranch has been completely covered up. Maybe the, like the green dots, the flaming hot. Flaming hot and cool together? How could it be? There's an incredible complimentary nature. You're getting basically what you get in like a hot buffalo wing and ranch that you put on that. But And I'm glad it, we tasted this one first. Is it covering up the beauty too much? Now I, I gotta go for the one that you told me not to get, just for. It's kind of hard hitting versus elegance. These are both so good. Why, are they, why is this the first round? Like, yeah. These are both so good. All right, I'm ready to vote. Okay, we're going to start with Rhett and Link first. Please uh, pick up your Doritos paddles and vote for your favorite. Three, two, one. We did it. We did it. All we need is one to agree with us. Okay, now, here, now, let, Maybe let, I don't think we need anybody to agree with us. Do you, I think that they're useless. Do you think the, the wow. chips will make a wow. case? You think the chips make a case for themselves, and we don't need to argue? Because I, because I have <laughs> yeah. a reason. I mean, to no. be clear, when you want to get a panel on your side for the entirety of a game, starting off the game with just like crapping all over the panelists about how much you hate them is an interesting tactic. I love the panel, and let me just say, the reason that I chose Cool Ranch, even though I think that's an exquisite chip, is I think the Cool Ranch... You didn't you did. choose Cool Ranch. Oh. <laughs> Well, uh, you know what? Somehow adding more people made me into Link today. <laughs> so are you changing your vote? <laughs> okay. Democracy in action. All right. So now I take back what I said. Can I? Can we I? We need you. Can, can, can I say? I don't think you get to say anything I think else. I, no, no. You, you both. You both anything. get to make your case. First of all, let me just defend my, defend my mix up because that chip is red. See. That's why I chose it. I forgot about the color of this is the only thing that matters. Okay, the reason I ended up choosing 
Cool Ranch is because I think the flavor is so perfect already that it gets really, really good, and I love the spice, but I feel like it compromises something that was perfect to begin with. That's, that's I mean, I love that chip. I, it, it pains me to not vote for it. So but we're so that you did. We're um, split. I think it's the best of both worlds. I take back what I said. We do need you, but I, I'm not trying to stroke your ego. I just want you to, um, to say what you think. Okay, what? panel. What do you think? It took Kaylin a little second to figure it out. I thought there was All a All right, count, so though. they're with me. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna, listen, I don't feel too bad because this is a, such a tight race. So I actually feel like, I feel great about giving over the power to the panel because now I feel like they helped me make a decision that I couldn't make on my own. I mean, I was I was blue first, I mean, come on. <laughs> but I, so ironically, after all of that work to take my vote out of the contention, they agreed with me. Yeah. More well, often than not. It's not, not everybody. With yeah, you though. didn't, Jordan. Yeah, it's just. I think Rhett is 100% right. I think this fl this flavor is perfect. And when you add the flaming Hot to it, it's still good, but it takes away the unique deliciousness of a Cool Ranch Dorito. Kaylin, we know you like spicy. Yeah, but I don't like Cool Ranch at all. Like, oh. not even a little bit. Oh, wow. It's my, sorry, it's my controversial opinion, but. Were you torn, Matt? No, well, this is uh, more flavor. More flavor, better. <laughs> there you go. Good. Every man. So, the Cool Ranch is going into the, the pits of torment. Okay, now that we've figured out how all this works, our next flavor contender is Flamas, a spicy Flamas. lime flavor. And so the alphabetical dark. order has delivered us a nice pairing for round two. Mm. Flame against flame. Flamas. The lime flavor is nice. Hitting hard. Man, Doritos knows what they're doing. Let me just say that. They don't make any missteps. So we got hot and lime versus hot and cool. Mm. Okay. This is an easy one for me. I'm ready to vote. I think I'm in agreement with you in terms of it being easy. Okay, Rotten Lake. Yep. Three, two, one. Cool Ranch. Cool Ranch hot is yep. better. Yeah, the lime is just too strong and it's too niche for me. So I like we, it, but now, that's perfect. All we need is one. What you guys got? Ooh, Ooh! We got it, Jordan! Thank you for bringing us home! Now we know why Kaylin voted against these, because you just don't like the Cool Ranch at all, right? Well, I mean, like, this is more flaming Hot. This was actually a lot harder of a choice, but I like the lime a little bit better. Okay, Lieb? Uh, more flavor. <laughs> more flavor, good. So, yeah. hot plus lime <laughs> equals so much goodness. Yeah. So. I, I I agree with that, but that more flavor is too limey. Mm. When you what do you think, Jordan? Yeah, I think that uh, the flamas tastes a little bit like a less delicious taki. So it, I just I'm comparing it to that, and it's not as good to me. So I got to go with the cool ranch. The sad taki gets burnt. Bite. Ooh, set to be another difficult round. It's limon, a flaming hot variety of Doritos. How's this gonna be different? It's the same as flamas, right? No. But kind of. It's different but similar. Yeah. You know what I'm gonna do. I don't even need to taste that one again. I've been eating it the whole time. I like the flamas a little you, better you, than those. When you go to that and you get the cool ranch and the heat together, it's so, it's so good every time I come back to that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, three, two, one. Sticking with the ranch and the hot together. Yeah, it's so good. All right, panel. All we need is one. And uh -huh. we got two. Oh. Matt Lee, what's your what's your issue here? You think this is more flavor again? Yeah, yeah. I like <laughs> yeah. lemon. It's like lime, but it's uh, you know a little more lemony. Yeah. What was the word for him? Proletariat. Every man. Every Proletariat. Man. I'm oh. a, I'm anti latariat. You know what? Would, would you would you like the honors? Oh yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Here he said, go. ooh, at the same time, we have the classic Doritos flavor nacho cheese versus Cool Ranch Flamin' Hot. So much flavor has happened in my mouth, starting with the hot, that I'm gonna have to eat a few of these to get readjusted. It's like eating a lifelong companion, you know? Such a good feeling. Don't do that to me. <laughs> Am I getting pulled in by the, the Matt Lee proletariat argument? <laughs> it's like, which bowl are you drawn back to more? You know? Okay. This is not terribly easy, but I'm ready. Three, two, one. Went with the original. Ooh, 
Coke? What? Why? why I not? thought. I thought that I was going to go with original. When I saw him, I was like, there you are, old love. Right. But then I went into my brain, and the brain wanted to go back to this bowl more than this bowl, and so I'm just going on instinct. Okay, do you guys have any swaying for arguments for the panel? Because you need two on the panel. I, 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 I was almost on the fence, so I, I'm really interested in what you guys are going to produce here. Yeah, I would be fine with either of these moving on, so I don't want to sway you. I want to see what your real opinion is. Okay, panel, let's see. Ooh. Whoa! Complete Not agreement. Not even close. Now, Kaylin, you don't like cheese, you said. So yeah. Well, like I actually don't mind the nacho cheese, but I you don't like, like cheese. No, but I like the spice in this better. <laughs> I mean, Jordan, what about you? I mean, this mm. is you got you got to give credit to the original. Absolutely, I think both are delicious. Just to be clear, um, this one is just giving more. This is a little underwhelming once you've had this one. So. You know, I'm sorry, old friend, but we've upgraded. Yeah. Spicy. It's like when you watch like an old movie and it was like, everyone loved this in the 60s. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I get that. And you're like, yeah, yeah. it ain't the 60s anymore. <laughs> like, we got better technology. I hate to do it. Well, boy. But I just did it. Yep. Now we have Nacho Flamin' Hot <laughs> versus Cool Ranch Flamin' Hot. I'm Wait. glad that this is the next one because. It's, it's almost a chance for nacho vindication. Mm. I don't think I've ever tasted these side by side, but in my mind, there's an overwhelming favorite. I am taken aback by the amount of chips you've eaten already, Rhett. <laughs> yeah, you're killing like. it, dude. <laughs> this is why my opinion it matters more. Okay. Because I eat a whole lot more. All right, Rhett and Link, you ready? Three, yep. two, one. One. Sticking with Cool Ranch. Cool Ranch. So are you, yeah. The balance. It's the balance of flavor. The nacho cheese gets a little bit lost in that, mm -hmm. but the cool and the hot together, yep. I think we have the perfect chip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do y'all agree? Yeah. Absolutely. Most of you. Wild card need not speak in this oh. one. <laughs> okay. Well, hold we, on. You can you, speak wild card. <laughs> okay. it's, her it's her cheese. No, Phobia. no, no, I voted. She for chose the cheese. Oh, yeah, you have to speak. <laughs> yeah, no, it's just like eating this reminded me why I don't like Cool Ranch. Like, it, like, it made it stand out more in the Cool Ranchness versus just spice versus no spice. You don't like cheese, but you don't like ranch more. I don't like Cool, cool Ranch. ranch. More. Cool There's ranch. a difference. Yeah. Yeah, There's yeah. a difference. Between you that like that going to ranches. ranches. Yeah, yeah, of yeah. course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like Jordan's a... face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm just going with my gut. Sorry. Wow. <laughs> I do. I respect that, but I do think you're right. I think the hot and the cool. It's perfect. You cannot go wrong. And I think the nacho cheese one tastes way less spicy. Yeah, but it's mm. nice though. It's a nice combo. Also, more flavor, better. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That, it's got that flame and hot. It's got cool and it's got ranch. That's three versus mm -hmm. flame and hot and just nacho cheese. That's yeah. Right. Uh huh. Okay, Cool Ranch, Flamin' Hot are hanging on, but yep. does Salsa Verde have what it takes? There's so many spicy Dorito oh. chips. I forgot about these, man. What a unique taste. It tastes jalapeno. Got a, I love a jalapeno spice on things, man. I just want to have a chip buffet. You at my are. birthday party. I don't know how wide the invites are going to be, so. Oh. Well. Just enjoy this I moment. might just <laughs> See, at this point, I think we're tempted to throw a vote here just because of the just the domination. This is a really good chip. That this has had. And are you being enamored by it just because it's different? It's not flaming hot anymore. Potentially. I'm ready to vote. I'm ready to vote. Three, two, one. I can't, it's not better. I can't, no, can't it's so switch good, it up. but it's not better. It's a one and done type taste for me. Okay, well, you were pretty convincing that you liked the Salsa Verde, so what are you going to tell the panel about sticking with your Cool Ranch Flamin' Hot? I'll un I will guess I'll understand if you choose Salsa Verde. I no. mean, I, <clears throat> I won't fly off the handle or anything. But it's a very underdog type thing to do. Huh? It would be a weird choice, I think, at this point in the game, but it's, you know, it's cool. Whatever. Yeah. Okay, panel. <laughs> weird it's so choice. Good. It's not a weird choice. It's so tasty. It's it is a great chip. Yeah. It's a great chip. It's a lot better. Yeah, in nothing, my opinion. Nothing wrong with it. We know you don't like it, so you're you're against it. 
I'm not, you're I mean, against like, you're against the domination. No, I don't think so. Not like regardless of domination. I like whatever. them both. <laughs> right, that's, but what, that's not I, how voting works. That's what a democracy is all about, guys. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to extend an olive branch oh, to you. I have to get rid of it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I can't even. It's see. fun though. There you Yay! go. Okay, we have simply organic white cheddar now. Simply organic. There's nothing simple about being organic. All right. I do not have to taste the other chip. <laughs> you can't you can't use DNA manipulation. I'm fine with that. You can't That's, use I, I, pesticides. The organic part is fine. It's just it doesn't taste good. I don't know what organic means, I guess. <laughs> You're thinking about non-GMO. Where's the cheese? Where's the flavor? These are not good. This is Dorito's first mistake. Okay, today. panel, do you agree? Yes! Look at that! Yeah, I mean, do we- No it, flavor. They're, they're gross. We no don't flavor. need to discuss. We just move on to the next vote. Yeah. We're yeah. efficient no politicians. We hate organic. <laughs> uh, nope, that's not the message. That's not the message. <laughs> that's it, it. <laughs> yes, it is. Next up, spicy nacho. Yet again, another spicy nacho permutation. Well, if you just walked to me on the walked up to me on the street and asked me what my favorite Dorito is, I think I would have said spicy nacho before today. It's more nacho than spicy, whereas all the other nacho spices were spicy than nacho. It really retains the corniness of of, of the chip as well. It doesn't cover up the corn. Okay. One. It's not doing, dude. That's still amazing. not doing. There's something scientific about what they've done here. Yeah, that's doing something to my brain. Every time I go back to it, you're like, "Oh yeah, you're back." Are you with us, constituency? <laughs> it's okay. Magic. It's a magic chip. Yeah. Crying. <laughs> yeah. When it's just so good. It's just every time I have it, it's the best thing I've ever had. <laughs> Kaylin, at this point, I feel like it's getting awkward. Um, oh. <laughs> you know, but we kind of know where, this is why there's five of us, right? Mm -hmm. Is Kaylin becoming the new me? <gasps> uh, How dare wow. you? Wow, was this all, all along the plan? That's why I extended that olive branch, even though it didn't make sense. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. I feel like, hey, you do you, because yeah. I do me, and we can do us. us. Well, you know what? I think hey, this stay is actually, out of this. I think having Kaylin, <laughs> this actually, I think it's good for you to observe this, right? Because in this setting, Kaylin is saying things like, Science "I don't like things. nacho cheese," and "I don't like Cool Ranch." This feels like a very link thing to say, but in this context, there's five of us, and so it kind of doesn't matter, <laughs> you know. And you just happen to agree with all, with us when it comes to Doritos, but there's a lot of other things in which you would be representing this. So, yes, to answer your question, today Kaylin is you. Let's do this. Let's do this one together. How? That's gonna be hard I don't know. <laughs> How? Introducing spicy sweet chili. These are so good. It's a good looking chip. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Matt Lieb likey. Mmm. Well, it's complex too. That's doing a lot for me. I feel like. It's just a Chinese food uh, Dorito. Okay, this is a, okay. Hey, <laughs> this isn't easy for me anymore. Okay. I'm ready. Three, two, one. I'm doing it. I'm going sweet chili because what happened was something about the sugar content and the sweetness tapped into the part of my brain that has kept me going back to these the whole time. I know the fact that this has been up there the whole time is giving me a little bit of sway towards this, but this is the first one that legitimately is a contender, and I think it's just a little bit better to me in this moment right now. I'm only in the mood for Chinese food like I don't once know why every you're six saying weeks. Chinese food. It just tastes like the dip, like the wonton dip. Sweet chili sauce? Yeah. That's what flavor it is. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So why doesn't he understand? It's just an odd comparison is all. Okay, yeah. panel, what, what thanks, say thanks, you? Hey, thanks for being here, guys. <laughs> Go! No. It doesn't uh, matter, Lieb! Your vote doesn't matter, Lieb! I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> Let's go. Look at you guys. You guys! What, yeah. hap what happened? I was pressured. I love sweet chili. Yeah, they're I delicious. It. It's the only other flavor that is 
has this complexity that there's a few stages to it. Mm -hmm. For Link, it's just, I'm in a Chinese restaurant, it's the only stage. So For me, weird. they're sweet and there's chili. So it's doing the same kind of thing that Cool and a Hot and Ranch mm -hmm. is doing, but in a different world. Yeah, three flavors. I'm not getting rid of that. <laughs> Let me just say, what a stand. What a stand by Flaming Hot Cool Ranch. Yes. Every man stands for Cool Ranch. It's so good. But today, it wasn't good enough. I want. <laughs> but how are you going to feel about sweet and tangy barbecue? It's a weird flavor for a Dorito. I mean, a weird color. And a weird flavor. Because barbecue with the corn. Yeah, because it's got that very... Nobody saw that. Lay's barbecue taste. But superimposed on a corn chip. Is it too I am. I'm too against much, this. Too much sweet. I, I'm against this. You ready to vote? Yeah. Three, two, one. Um, I. I don't like either one of these. <laughs> Here we go. Hey. I, I almost abstained. <laughs> you know what? I love this. I am going to abstain. I'm out. Oh. Me too. <laughs> Solidarity. I guess that is something that happens in politics. People just don't show up sometimes. That's true. Uh, panel? It doesn't matter, Link. Yeah. Sweet I'm, chili. They're great. Yep, yep. They're moving on. I knew that was going to happen. I'm, I'm okay with that. It's a cool bag, though. Okay, y'all. This is the last contender, Tapatio. I know that these are good. Oh, my. I'm not going to taste that again. Cause... It captures all the... Complexities of Tapatio perfectly matching them with a Dorito. I'm gonna need a moment, okay? Rhett has eaten the equivalent <laughs> of two and a half bags of chips today already. Hey, when you need to, when you need to fill up a big truck, you put a lot of gas in it. It's true. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, you know where I stand. Three. I, two, I can't abide by that. One. <sighs> you did it, huh? You switched over. I think Tapatio It's cohesive. It's so good. It's Boy, it's so good. And it has the spice and the sweet and the hot and so uh. This is for everything. The, the panel, panel has this never overridden us. So I feel good about that. Panel, what say you? Yes! Still. We're going for it. Oh. So good. Sweet chili is better. Okay, sweet chili is an excellent flavor. Let's give it its moment in the sun. We already did. So I'm gonna get rid of that. Bam. But here's the thing. Oh, I just popped the barbecue. Only here for one round. Only here for one there round. There it is. And standing as the official flavor that we are inducting into the Flavor Hall of Fame, Tapatio Doritos. Yes. Raise to the rafters, baby. Oh, I didn't get a good clip here. We don't want it to fall off once it gets in the rafters. Ah. It'll be there forever. You look good up there, Tapatio. You came in late and you wowed us all. What do you think? You like this? Are we crazy? <laughs> That's what the comments are for. And you know what, panel? Thank you for your honest contributions and um, I'm sorry for being harsh at any turn. I'm full. Yeah, me too. Thanks, Thanks for subscribing, subscribing and clicking that bell. bell. Now y'all say you know what time it is. You, you know, know what, what time, time it is. is. I'm Jen. I'm Anya. I'm Wes. I'm Sheridan. You can call us Jaws. And we're on a, in a botanical garden on the island of Oahu. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. <laughs> Oahu. Having a good time. Thanks for thinking of us. Click the top link to watch us discover the craziest Doritos, Doritos <laughs> trivia and get mythical more. And to find out where the wheel of mythicality is going to land. You can check out written versions of past gut checks, blind taste tests, and rankings over on sports.com.